Greetings, friends. Jawless Paul here. We're playing Path of Exile again. Um, we are just continuing in our epic adventure with the uh, the Spell Slinger Witch, and I don't know. Things are things are going really well. Way way better. If you had told me, if you had told me before I started that we would make it to level 50, I would have said, hmm, I don't. I would be surprised. I thought for sure I'd die at Malachi or, or Dominus, but truthfully, the only enemy that really gave us any issue, uh, we'll go through the Western Forest in just a minute, but there is a there is a quest in here, I guess. Um, <laughs> Merveille was really the only thing that gave us a ton of a ton of issues. Holy cow, this is awesome. Um, I'm gonna just lower the master volume just a smidge. It it just seems like it might be a little loud. I could be I could be wrong. I know that uh, the way I hear it in my headphones is not perfect, uh, perfectly the way it is. Okay, so this is like a mirroring thing, which is sort of weird. Um, all right, so I think if I sell both of these, I get I get something. I'm not. Okay, yeah, mirrored. If I sell both of those together, I think I get a a special something. So I can't remember exactly what it is. Um, but anyway. Okay. Yeah, I mean once again, we we don't we don't have to do much thinking in this build. Uh, it's a very it's very solid without a whole lot of difficulty. Oh nice, we've got uh, we got some of these. There's there's some really good items you can get from these from these uh from these what have you's. Now <laughs> we happen to also get a, a beast, so we're gonna spend some time in here, I guess, getting getting all these beasts because there's a lot of really good stuff from the beasts too. I don't know. I'm I feel very very pleased about this <laughs> this the way things are going here. Um, oh wait, that's not that's not what I want. Was this the last one? No, it wasn't. Oh, it went he went over here. Okay. I often, I often miss where, uh, when it, it tapers off like that. Alright, it's up here, apparently. Alright, is it, is it never going to, is it, will it ever finish? It looks like it just finished. And we leveled up. How, how fun is that? It's, I'll tell you, I'll tell you how fun it is. It's very fun. And did it go off again, or did we... We have a trove. Hypnotic Eye Jewel. I forget what the hypnotic ones uh, do. Global Critical Strike Chance. That's fine. Ivory Bow doesn't really work for us, so we'll, we'll pass on that. Um, I think I need to... Yeah, I need to kill this beast. But until then, let's, let's head over here and uh, grab this damage so that's basically it's 15% increased damage that's what that's what that note is it's, but it's totally worth it we will be best friends beast until we slaughter you <laughs> I don't know man he seems kind of like a meanie to me he's kind of a meanie Being essence of war. Okay. More more beasts. Okay, this is this is kind of dangerous because I believe those enemies do chaos damage. We do not have a whole lot of chaos uh, damage mitigation. So hey, alright. A unique mace or scepter. It's kind of fun. I don't know that a horn scepter is all that good, but it's it's something. Okay, we need one more. One more. And here it is. Done. Done done. An accelerating hunt exile. Now it is time for Aina to go to Aina business. <laughs> what? <laughs> Einar to go to Einar business? Okay, uh the cloven one is gonna be over here somewhere, right? Valley of the Fire Drinker? Wait, ah. Uh. Let's see, world screen. 
The cloven one is supposed to, it, it is in Prisoner's Gate, so we gotta keep, we gotta keep exploring. It's probably one of these goat, it's a, it's an elite goat man, I'm guessing. It's, it's just incredible to me, the way this build works, like, it's so, it's so stinking amazing. Uh, things are real nuts over here right now. We gotta harvest this so we get some of that. This might actually lead to us getting, um, getting enough essence to do, to do good stuff. Uh, right? We got a grain. Don't need a spiny mole. Okay, so, now... It needs vivid essence in condensed form. So we definitely need to um, get vivid essence, like condense the vivid essence. Uh, a life modifier, huh? We, most of our stuff already has a, a life modifier. Reforge. Augment an item with a new life modifier. So could we do that with this shield is the question. Our inventory is so stinking full. I doubt we need it. We don't need a tiger's paw. Um, so if we take... We probably don't need a sleek coat either, to be honest, but we'll just leave it on the floor for now. All right. If we take these out, is this the right item type? Is the, I don't know. I don't know that it is. But we can get some extra intelligence, and that would be amazing. Alright, that intelligence. Life. 19 life. Not the best roll ever, right? Like, it, it certainly, certainly could have been a lot better, uh, but, but it's still something. Okay, condensing uh, life force there. And we'll pick these back up. And so now, it's, why isn't this dispensing? This, it's within, it's within range. Oh, here we go, here we go, here we go. It's got it now. It's got it. Okay, so it's got the, it's got the, what it needs. What it needs to grow. Um, this is another grain. And it has what it needs to grow too. Sweet! We've got, we've got two grains. We've got two grains going. Um, I actually feel, oh, but this guy needs, this guy needs the Vivid as well. Um, can we make that happen right now? Uh, we we might be able to make that happen. We've got a disperser. Ugh, inventory. Come on, inventory. What the heck? I think I am just going to... Am I really going to use this? No, I am not. Um, let's, let's just see real quick if we can get this this set up a little bit um i want it right here right and i want it connected over here is that too far yeah no i don't want that but okay but maybe we need to do this oops good enough connect that to that that to this and go and my my question yes it it does will it will it be enough oh it, it is enough oh it needs one more wild seed so maybe i can plant some right here okay i don't have any don't have any, <laughs> anything to plant here okay well at least we got the at least we got that going okay yeah we're we're we've got some some good things going on now it's so messed up though. It's so, it's so messed up. Well, let's harvest this. Is that everything? That is everything. Well, would you look at that? Okay. Linking four sockets. Do we want that on our boots? Probably, I mean, that would make it better, maybe? But is it, I don't think it's that much better. A lightning modifier. This already has a lightning modifier. 
Yeah, well, I think we'll just condense this because there's nothing really that I want to uh, to go there. And then we'll we're filling up our we'll fill, we're filling that up a little bit as we as we go, so we can eventually plant some grains. It's like I'm I'm starting to figure it out, but it's still it still feels uh, quite complicated, just in terms of like making everything happen the way the way you want it to um that's all right okay let's go i'm gonna go <laughs> clear out my inventory a little bit because otherwise we're gonna be playing the inventory management game all the time and that's Welcome. that's no fun okay let's just identify all this junk cold damage lightning to attacks yeah that's not that's not gonna work for us Not a bad, it's not a bad serrated foil. Maybe, I mean, it's hard to say. Oh, a chance to poison on hit. I mean, is that, is that pretty good? I have no idea. Uh, it's got lots of energy shield, but. Dodge spell. Interesting. Uh, yeah, we sell those two. We get an orb of chance. Okay. Stay right. sharp out there. Completed a vendor recipe. Orb of chance. Look at that. Um, okay, and let's go to our jewels and flasks. Oh, those are mirrored too. I mean, that's kind of that's kind of cool as well. But anyway, okay, we need to figure out, we need to get a cluster, we've got a cluster gem and we need to get this uh, in place at some point uh, for sure. So we've got a, okay, and then we've got our cards page here. Oh, did we never sell this? Oh yeah, we thought maybe we'd wanna sell it on the market. I don't know. I don't know if I'm gonna go down that path really. I, I wouldn't even know what to sell it at, so. We'll, we'll keep it in our inventory because we've got lots of space and I'm clearly not, you know, I'm not a power player right now, you know, needing all of my inventory space uh, in my stash, anyway. All right, where, where should we go for this Cloven One business? Maybe we do need to go into the other, defeat the Cloven One. Maybe he is over here. We'll have to just see. That does that does look like a cloven. Aha. There's the cloven one. There's the cloven one. Yeah. Yep, we got him. He ran away. Feller, Feller uh, ran away. So we got to go on to the Cloven Pass. I remember this guy. I remember this fight. Valley of the Soul Drinker. I think our damage is, is quite good. I mean, it, it, and it got a lot better with the 15% extra what have you. Okay, so we got we got the cloven one. All right. At last, your thirst is quenched. Okay, so now, good souls. now we can use the, the soul of Abareth. Reduce fire damage taken while moving, unaffected by burning ground. I mean, I don't, I think this is better because we're moving a lot. <laughs> that's my, that's my justification for that. All right. Back to Prisoner's Gate. Super. All right. So now let's just go to the Western Forest, get to the waypoint there. 
and then we'll kind of we'll kind of rock and roll. Anything else we need to do? Lattice ring mail. An orb of regret. I love that it it's uh, kind of highlighted on the on the minimap there. That's great. I mean, there's good. This is good experience too. Like, there's no reason not to uh, kind of kill everything in here. Okay. No need for a totemic mall. Contempt. Superior sacred life flask. I don't think sacred is what we're after right now. Pretty sure. I think we've moved on to better, better types of things. Rallying cry. Let's go ahead and head back to Lion Eyes and turn in the quest. I actually don't know if he gives me a, a skill point. He does. How awesome is that? Okay. Uh, all right. Now, basically, where's the closest socket that I can get to? Um, I, I see this one. That might be the best one, but... I don't know. It's hard to tell. Oh, a large jewel socket. Or a basic jewel socket. So, is this a large jewel socket? Is that what they're saying? <laughs> Place into an allocated medium or large jewel socket in the passive skill tree. Okay, medium or large. Okay, medium or large. A basic... Basic... Large. Is there a medium somewhere for me to look at? That's a large one. A basic. Medium. I mean, there's no... <laughs> they don't have medium listed. So I'm guessing basic will work. Uh, at least that's my hope. My hope is that basic will work. There's one... Wasn't there one right here? Socket. Okay, right there. There's a large one right there. Oh, we're really close to that one already. Oh, wait, wait, wait. We have one point left. Wait, we are, we're already, like, right there. We kind of want to go that direction anyway. Like, we want to get this elemental damage, so maybe we'll just move towards this large jewel socket. <laughs> we'll try that. I know okay. that... I know that there is a build that I'm, I'm like following and I should probably check on that. But part of me is also like, um, just keep, just keep doing, just keep doing what you're doing. This is a nice ax, right? I mean, it's not a bad ax. I'll, I'll hold on to it. If someone is watching this and thinks, "Hey, I need that axe," uh, please let me know, and uh, and you can you can have it. Um, I will I will give it to you. Okay, let's go. Let's just continue on through the western forest. Oh, he 
know what? I do want to... I actually do want to do this because we've got... I was thinking maybe I'd skip this one. But this... This continues... This Gather continues a thing. A harvest is ready. A harvest is ready, huh? That harvest is ready. But that's the one that's helping my... Oh, we don't have any more life force from the condensed? Doggone it. So maybe this is more of like a long... <laughs> this is like a long... Different from burying the dead, is it? It's strange to me that it's not. We don't have enough, but whatever. Okay. Sanctified life flask. That's all right. Oh, Valor. Very nice. I don't think I've ever corrupted a thing before, but but I like the idea of it. Requires more adjacent wild seeds to grow. Okay, so really, oh, okay, it's got enough. It's got enough vivid essence, but not enough. <laughs> not enough the other stuff. Okay. Randomize the numeric values of the random physical modifiers on a magic or rare item. Physical modifiers. Do we have any physical modifiers? Like probably on a weapon, I'm guessing. Uh, reading a fire modifier. Improves the quality of a flask by at least 10%. This greater effect on lower rarity flasks. Okay, I mean, maybe we should do it on this one, or maybe we should do the seething one. I don't know, man. I, I feel like it's not, oh, Tate, 20%, very nice, very nice. Uh, it's probably not, it's probably not great. Reforge a rare item. The thing is, all these rare items that I found, I already really like, so. I don't know if I want to reforge them. We'll just condense it, I guess. Hopefully we have somewhere to store it all. Yeah, this one's this one's not full, so that's good. We'll grab a sanctified life flask, portal scroll. Um, and then we need to drop off some seeds. Or a seed at least. Two seeds. Okay. Looks like I forgot to uh, turn in my uh, my currency items. Blood rage. I love it. the fireballs go flying across the screen to find find enemies. I like it a lot. Alright, the riverways. I think we might we might be able to travel to the forest to, to Mervale's caverns. Maybe. And and hopefully hopefully fight the Brian King. I don't know if we'll have time for that. I'm not sure. I'd love to try it. Right, what's over here? Is my question. The wetlands. Do we? Okay. Do we go to the? We go to the wetlands. I I don't rightly know. a waypoint. There's another one of these. The Alright. To, to the grove. Can we... 
Okay, good. We need more vivid vivid life force, that's for sure. Oh wow, we had a lot of those. That's great. Alright. Um I'm gonna see if I can at least figure out where the Mervale's caverns are. We're probably running out of time for anything beyond that, but let's just keep going. Whoa, we got we're we're like stuck. I've never been stuck like that before. There was like uh there was like stuff that <laughs> we were stuck. Alright, alright. Okay, we got a lot of things to level up. Okay. I'm I'm gonna guess that Murville's caverns are going to be. Well, I don't know. I guess I, I really don't. Searching for Nessa. Defeat the puppet. The puppet mistress. Let's go wetlands, I guess. And then let's look at the world map. See if, if maybe we've figured this out. Okay. Brian King is the other direction. So we'll go the other way. We'll, we'll do the puppet mistress, but I want to at least get to Mervale's, uh, Mervale's caves. You know? Know what I mean? Um, and I'm hopeful that we can go this way. Can we just follow the road. There's there's a good chance that the road will take us where we need to be. I mean, it's really just like, it's really just very basic what you have to do here. Oh, there's some, this is, here's a guy. Here's a fella. Ambush boots. Blade blast. Sounds exciting, but it's not something we'll probably use, but still, it sounds exciting. Not, not the thing. Okay. There's a... Thing to the side. Hmm. Ooh. We nearly. The southern forest. Okay. Now. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Southern forest is what is what leads to the fall area, I want to say. We've got five of these to grab. Very cool. Spike glove. Giant light. Yeah. Okay. It's like, I wanna, I wanna help you, man, but I've got a lot of things to do. Antidor's lost love. Cobalt jewel. We probably want cobalt jewels. They have the potential to be pretty good. I know I see the thing. However, I want to uh, I want to continue on my way. Good heavens. Okay. Do we... Where do we go? 
I feel like the screen is so busy and we're in such a rush. But, uh, okay, there's another... Aspect of the Hellion. It's a new one. It's a new one for us. We will be best friends, Beast, until we you. <laughs> mm. Peta. Peta is not a fan of this guy, I'm sure. I am so sure. Um, crossover again. There's a Vol. A vault place? I don't want to go to the vault place. I don't want to go to there. Oh, it's over here. Ah, sneaky. It's so it's so well hidden over there. Is this where we want to be? Perhaps. Perhaps it is. We're back. Can I make it? I cannot make it. Need two more beasts, so maybe they're maybe they're right next to each other. It's possible that they are. Matic orb. There's one. Okay. And the last one. Juicy one exile. I think we got it. Yeah, we got it. Okay, we got them. We got them all. And now we just need to go to Mervale's cave. <laughs> Come on. Okay, it must be over here. But this is to the Vault Temple, right? Cavern of... Oh, no, no, no. We're here. Cavern of Anger. Perfect. Okay. Uh, so, there, there's Nyssa. Let's just talk to Nyssa and then we'll, we'll move on. His time has almost come. Then hope will be... I will be gone. Please, take the black flag. It once fluttered from the mast of the Black Crest, Wayland Roth's ship. Throw it into the flames of the beacon. It's your only chance of reaching me, of turning this tide. The king can't keep secrets like this from me any longer. It's just the way of things. Find me, please, before... Poor Nyssa. Mermaid, mermaided. Much clutter. She got mermaided. Okay. Let's identify all this and increase attack speed. I don't think we need any more attack speed, and this is pretty crappy. No movement speed. Good resistances. It's got good resistances. That's not good. That's. Oh, actually. That's pretty good. That's spell damage, man. I don't know. Hard to say. Hard to say. Okay. Well, friends, thank you so much for watching. I hope that you enjoyed this episode. We are frantically, frantically making our way to the end of this act. And then we get this large jewel socket. I'm excited about that. Um, but, yeah, leave a comment below if you like this, what's going on here. And uh, I hope to see you very, very soon. Take it easy. And we'll catch you in the next one. Peace.